Let's write 1 and 1 eighth, the fraction as a decimal. So we can start out by just saying 1, that's a whole number. So we're just going to put 1 here. Then we need to convert 1 eighth to a decimal. That'll give us 1 and 1 eighth, the fraction as a decimal here. So 1 divided by 8. So we could put 1 right here and see how many times 8 goes into 1. It doesn't go into 1. Let's put a 0 up here, the decimal point. Now we call it 10. 1 times 8, that's 8. So 10 minus 8 is 2. It doesn't go into 2. We could call this 20 if we moved over 1. 2 times 8 is 16. Subtract, we get 4. Call it 40. We'll move over 1. And 5 times 8, that gives us 40 when we subtract no remainder. So the fraction 1 8, that's equal to the decimal 0 0.125, or you could just call it 0.125. 1 plus 0.125, we end up with 1.125. So when we write the fraction 1 and 1 8 as a decimal, we end up with the decimal 1.125. That's it. This is Dr. B converting fraction 1 and 1 eighth to a decimal. The answer 1.125. Thanks for watching.